Hello, dear subscribers and guests of the channel. Since ancient times, people have been attracted by space and distant stars. But even the closest objects to Earth have not yet been fully studied. We don't know everything about the Moon either. However, some facts about her still do not cease to amaze us. One fact, it is generally believed that the Earth's natural satellite arose as a result of its collision with another planet, but there are questions about this version. Now scientists have proposed to consider the scenario of a possible capture of the Moon by the attraction of the Earth from a passing binary system. According to this version, the Moon once had a partner of comparable mass, like, say, Charon for Pluto. If such a pair turns out to be close enough to the Earth and at the same time does not fly too fast, the gravity of the planet will automatically capture one of the bodies and the second will be thrown away. Scientists modeled this process based on mathematical calculations and found out that in this case the Moon could have a more elongated orbit, but over time it would become circular. At the same time, the Moon should gradually move away, which is what really happens, and in the end, it turns out to be so far from the Earth that the Sun begins to compete with the planet for its attention. Calculations have shown that, in principle, the Earth could intercept on the fly something larger like Mercury or even Mars, but the orbit of such a body would be unstable. In this sense, the Moon has the most suitable dimensions. The essence of this phenomenon is explained very simply. Due to the elliptical orbit of the Moon, the distance between the Earth and the Moon varies from 357,000 kilometers to 406,000 kilometers. The nearest point is called perigee, and the farthest point is called apogee. The Moon is at perigee every 27.3 days, but this moment does not always coincide with the full Moon, so the coincidence of these two events is called a supermoon. The second fact. An interesting fact, when a meteorite falls on the Moon, the energy released on impact melts its fragments, some of which cool down and turn into small beads. Such beads were found in some quantities in samples of lunar soil brought to Earth as part of the Apollo mission. The third fact. The Moon has its own atmosphere, however, its chemical composition is very atypical for objects in the solar system. The fourth fact, the end of the world on Earth may come because of the Moon. Researchers do not exclude this option. Scientists at the US Paleontological Institute note that the Moon is moving away from Earth at an average rate of 3.78 centimeters per year. The Moon will be able to leave Earth's orbit if the holding force of gravity of our planet decreases. The Moon, like any celestial body, has its own gravity, which causes tides to occur on Earth. According to scientists, through the ebb and flow of the Earth's energy is taken away, as a result of which its rotation slows down. Perhaps someday the speed of rotation of the Earth will equal the speed of rotation of the Moon. In this case, they will turn to each other with the same side. Thus, they will contribute to a significant change in weather and climatic conditions. Then. Scientists do not exclude that the end of the world will occur. The fifth fact. Why is the moon bright yellow? It is known that the Earth's only satellite has a white-gray hue, but under some circumstances, it can change significantly. The most likely possibility of observing a satellite in this range is on wet days, after rain. This is because conditions of high humidity and pressure contribute to the absorption of light waves and the preservation of the yellow hue of the moon. In some cases, the Earth's satellite may acquire a bluish, red, and black hue, but even these processes will be a common illusion because in fact, the color of the Moon in space always remains the same. The sixth fact. Can large natural satellites of planets have their own satellites? There is no reason why such satellites could not exist theoretically, but in practice the orbits of such satellites will be stable only if they orbit very close to the surface of the large satellites and the large satellites are far enough away from their planets. Simply put, a stone several meters in size can fly around the moon or around Titan in a close orbit, just like artificial satellites launched by humans fly around them. But a large satellite will not be stable due to the fact that there is no scale correspondence. It will not fly very close, as it can be torn apart by the tidal forces of a large satellite, and it will not be able to fly far. Because sooner or later, it will be torn off by the influence of the planet. Perhaps this can also explain the absence of moons in Mercury and Venus. The seventh fact. What will happen to the water if the moon disappears? The entire mass of the world's oceans is stretched between the moon and the sun, creating two domes that follow them. Because of this, by the way, the tides happen. 
If the moon disappears, the water dome that it created by its attraction will burst, and the water will rush across the Earth in a crushing tsunami. The coasts will be wiped off the face of the Earth. When everything calms down, the sun will take control of the tides, which will decrease, but will not be the same as before. Such a catastrophe will lead to unpredictable climatic changes, ranging from temperature changes to the extinction of many species. See you among the stars. Watch my channel and subscribe. You will learn a lot of new and interesting things. Click on the bell to be the first to watch new videos on the channel.